So I'm going to take a few minutes and refill some of the Kongs to put in the freezer. So I don't have enough for all of the dogs in the shelter, obviously, but um, I keep these filled up and in the freezer and these work as well. Um, that way when we have dogs in quarantine who are on their own that need something a little longer lasting to keep them busy, they can have these. Um, we also have these kind, do you see the rats actually got a hold of that one? We have these kind where the, the sticks, which I keep back here, um, I keep those as well for, for dogs that are in quarantine. Um, I don't bother with giving chews like this to dogs that are out in group areas because they'll just fight over them, so it's not really safe. Um, speaking of which, I'll go ahead and get these distributed as well to the dogs in quarantine today. Try and keep them busy, keep them comfortable. I'll just let you guys hang out with me while I'm refilling all of this stuff. Uh, those ones, I think you put little treats in there. This one opened. There goes our power. Yep, generator is kicking on. This, I have no idea what's supposed to go inside of this one. It says Dental Kong, but I don't see how food's supposed to go in that one. This one looks like it holds treats. Okay. Sometimes in our videos, uh, you know, I'm asking for toys and asking for other stuff and people can clearly see that I have toys and things behind me. Um, but these are ones I keep in the office just because three days a week I manage the dogs that are in my quarantine. Um, and if I just leave this for the staff to do, the Kongs will end up getting moldy because they're overworked and they don't have enough time to collect and clean all of this stuff. So I work on that myself. That one, they're a bit small, maybe I'll put two in there. Got, the quarantine is completely filled right now, so this will keep them busy for a little bit. Vic, you're on a diet, otherwise, Vicky's over here begging. She wants a snack, but she's, she's on a diet and I've already given her a treat today. No more treats for you, chunky girl. She's like, how dare you? These ones, do those fit in there? They do. Okay, these ones are for this size. Let me take and put those in there. And I've actually got some pretty small dogs in quarantine that can safely have those. I might give this one to Errol. Yeah. Love snacks. Why is that one smaller than all the others? Yeah. Small ones. Okay, Vic, you've broken me down, huh? There you go. This just breaks my heart. Let's see if these ones will fit in here. It's like a glove. Perfect. Excellent. Um, with these, when I pick them up and clean them, I have to make sure to push whatever's in there out. Um, sometimes the dogs can get it out of there, sometimes they cannot. Um, and the last thing I need is crap molding in there. On these bigger size ones. So these ones, off brand, Tesco, doesn't really matter. They all, the dentist sticks, these fit in here nicely. So please do keep those coming because this box will be gone within a week or two at the pace I'm going. Um, and while I always aim not to have dogs in quarantine for long periods of time, uh, when a dog is new, it has to undergo two weeks of quarantine, and it's pretty lonely and boring in there, so having treats like this goes a long way to keeping them sane um, during their, their stay with us. Um, and then for other dogs, you know, it could be as little as three, four days they have to stay in for, um, healing up from a spay surgery or something like that. Um, but still, these things are nice for them. Adult Orlando pencil sticks, those also work. to the dog. 
most there. The ones that kind of slide in there a little bit easier, the dogs have a better chance of actually getting them out. <laughs> Some of them, they fit in there pretty snug. So. Well, you can only hear the puppies outside squealing. They want to be let out. I'll have a check on them here in a minute, just make sure they're not, nobody's stuck anywhere. Okay, see if they get wedged in there too much. It's just better to barely, barely put it in there. Yeah, I cannot believe you just finished that dimple snack. Yeah, when Luis asks why you're fat, I'm gonna tell her I had no choice because your teeth needed to be brushed. Why you put me in this position? She's just looking at me like, please. Making me look bad, chunky girl. Making me look bad. Okay, these are all not, they're not like uniform size. <laughs> Hero Dental Minty Chews, suitable for medium dogs. Vic, you're not going to get one from each thing, she's just here begging. Absolutely not. Right. You can have a little piece that broke off only. Looks like it's good enough. It's good enough. Okay, that's all of the dental treats that I have room for. Now I will move on to filling the other one some uh, tubo snack, but if you guys want to send us the, the specific stuff that goes in the column that's got the little sprayer, that would be great. Um, and if I had thought about it this morning, I would have just picked up some plain yogurt. So these ones are really good for giving uh, pills, but the salmon one tends to be, it's a pate, it's just a little bit thin, so it doesn't hold very well to the pills. So I usually go and grab that and I keep it for squirting into the, the kongs and then freezing it. Put that in there. You can hear them scratching on the door. Everybody wants in while I'm refilling the, the treats. A little dusty. Just really haven't used that one in a while. Vic, how about not? Just relax, please. Vicky's like, please, I need to. Look at our, our sad little face. <laughs> I need to get her weight down before we send her to a new home. <laughs> we try to make it a point not to send obese dogs out to, to new homes. Okay. If I can squeeze even a drop out of that, I'll give it to you, Vic. Yeah, you're going to get me in trouble, dude. No, you can't have the whole tube. There you go. There's like a, the teeniest smidge left in there. So these West Paw design ones are nice. They're a little bit easier for me to clean. Um, and also when you sit them up in the freezer, they don't leak. Um, whereas the Kongs, because they're open on both ends, they do tend to leak a bit um, if they're not inside of a, a container. Yeah, this is the dental one. I wonder if I put just a little bit of tubo snack in either end. Or maybe if I put it in here and then froze it. I'll try that. I'd hope if I opened it first. <laughs> Good lord. What time is it? It's already after one o'clock. I just went out and uh, checked on, on Dahlia's wounds and she, thank, thank goodness I, I put a cone on her because she had, uh, had laid down in her bath and, and wet the bandage so that did not stay on. Um, I have no idea if this is how you're supposed to use this, but how I'm going to use it. You guys are welcome to tell me in the comments if I'm doing it wrong. People are quick to do that. Let me get some other treats to go in here. Got some Omni Vet Formulated plant-based treats for shiny coats. I'm just going to sprinkle a few of these in here with the, the Pet Pal Tubo Snack before popping that in the freezer. It interesting for the dogs. There we go. I'm going to the freezer. I've got one more Kong. This one hasn't even been opened yet. Okay, weak hands. There we go. <laughs> it actually seems a little sun damaged. I don't recall leaving this one out. Odd. Um, I'll have to lay this one down on its side because I'm out of room. Okay. Oh, I've got one more Kong in the strainer. 
jumbo size one for a few of our bigger dogs. Um, I usually save this one for Mufasa. He's one of our biggest dogs and he lives primarily on his own. Um, however, today I let Medusa have a, a crack at it. She was begging for attention and I didn't have any to give today. So I got a snack instead. Let me drop a few of these little treats in there. Vicky, you are not getting more snacks now, I swear. Luis watches these videos. What's going to happen if she sees me giving you snacks when you have gained weight? Vicky's like, I don't care. Look at her. She's making my life very difficult. She's jumping on my leg. She's making me feel awful. She's like, how dare you put snacks without me and being involved? She's the official snack taste tester. Not anymore, Miss Lady. You know, it's funny, actually, she's not even that, that food motivated. Like, she's begging for this, but if I offered it to her, she wouldn't eat half of it. And yet her weight just stays the same or goes up, despite my best effort. It's really irritating. So I don't know how this is supposed to actually be used, but I'm going to tuck little treats in here. And then along with the Kong stuff, I'm going to go hand this out to the dogs that are in quarantine. Hopefully it'll keep them busy for a little bit. And I don't know, maybe I could stick a, a one of the dental snacks through there out the window watching Billy <laughs> play with a toy. I don't remember smashing my finger. I think I was back in Lucy's section. It actually felt like a burn. This dog kind of rang my bell today. Snacks are gonna stay in here, but I'll give the old college try. All right, now I'm gonna go hand those out and put this stuff in the freezer. Those are, there. Those are all packaged. Those will be ready for next week. I will hand them out on Wednesday. I'm gonna head out to hand out these ones right now in quarantine. I'm not gonna be able to bring the camera with me because I only have so many hands. <laughs> 